Greetings and salutations, gamers. This is Eliza85, episode 87 of Let's Play Final Fantasy 7 with DKS3A. In the last episode, we went to Cosmic Canyon, talked to Guggenhagen, and he told us to go to, uh, he wanted to go to the Forgotten City to look around at some stuff. So we went to the Forgotten City, and he told us that we had to go find this key. And luckily, we know where the key is at. First thing first, we need to head down to Junon. We go grab our submarine. It's right over here. Let's we'll get turned the camera. Yeah, that's fine. The yeah, it's a purple dot. It's got a little purple dot over there, which is a little submarine. So let's go. There. Yeah, and uh, there's our submarine. Now we need to head uh, north. All the way to where we were just at. In our submarine. So basically we just need to head just north. <laughs> Wait until we get north because... Uh... Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Once we get to north, and when we need to go out, then we'll sink. We may have to because I don't know if we can go across the shallow water. Pick up some. Uh -huh. There's a can. Okay. Alright, then we just need to head north from here. Sorry, I don't like the controls of the sub. Yeah, the, the controls of the sub is not that good. Mm. Alright. There we are. So let's continue heading through here. It should lead us to the cave right here. And inside this cave is the key! Now we just need to figure out how to sink. How do we sink? Okay, so that should lead us right to where we need to go. You think that's it? Analysis yeah. completed. Exact date of origin cannot be determined. Estimated to be several thousand years old. That sounds about right. Key of the ancients. Yep. And we get the key to ancients. Woo! Do you know what this means? We get all the way back to Junon, grab the high wind, and head all the way back to Bugenhagen. Joy! <laughs> all the way back to Bugenhagen in the ancients, and the Temple City of the Ancients. So, yay, but after that, we don't have to worry about this anymore, so, we'll be done. Alright, so let's just head back to go get the high wind and move on, all, get back on our way and just do this real quick. Mm. Shouldn't take it too long. Hope not. It better not. Hope not. It better. Oh, and off screen we rearranged some material and also bought 99 high potions. You can never be too prepared. No. Oh, there we go. Right there. I didn't just need a bark right up in there. Which will lead us right to the high wind, and then just take the high wind back to the bone village, back to the city of the ancients. Hooray! Get us out of here! Oh, thank you. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. Alright, so. Nothing we haven't seen already, but this shouldn't take us long. Alright. Alright. So, okay, back to the bone village. And.
I just wanted to go to a shop that guy at the bottom down here sells, sells the items. And that's when we got our 99 high potions. Or even after buying 99 high potions or so, we're going to Yay. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> we're good. <laughs> Yay. 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 Alright, back to this little area. Which, luckily, all you do is just here. There. Ah, got into a battle. Sorry. Shouldn't take us but just a second. Oh, cloud right. Really? Watch the ship. Oh, yeah. never mind. They got, they got dancing to us. So we probably need to get dance four times. Which sucks, but nothing we can do about it. Nope, oh, never mind. Just fight. And we still missed one. And uh, we didn't miss it that time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright. Dude, that was an experience. Alright. Got that over here, head through here, and a little quick pick stop. Back to Dugenhagen. Uh, hey, uh, gotta love all this backtracking annoying stuff. And every time we get to that area, all like three times we've been there, we've gotten into battle right there. Same creature too. Same creature too. Every time. <laughs> right. Does that creature just like live right in that little bitty spot? Guess so. Oh, MP plus bells up. Thirty percent. Yay. More MP for the Sid. Should be. Yeah, thirty percent. Every uh, star is an extra ten percent to the max fifty percent. But if you have two MP pluses at max, ten percent. Double the magic. Yeah. <laughs> Double the fun. Oh, All right, now just. And right here, back to the city of the ancients. Yes. Now just take the last path back to Dugahagen, let's give him this freaking key, and let's move on our way. You're stuck the rooms. Oh, well, one step closer. <laughs> we still got one more big area to go to before stuff off, so. <laughs> Get it. Oh, I hear this music. Boom. <laughs> Alright, so there, we're back here. The set up around back to Bugenhagen. Hello, Bugenhagen. We're here. We got our key. This is what you wanted, huh? There we are. Ah, yeah, and it. Yes, we did. Yay. It didn't take us but a couple minutes either. <laughs> that music box over here. We put the key in it. I'll go use the key you right here. Nope. And watch Fuzzy what happens. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing happens. Alright, you can hug him, but. Oh, ho, ho. There we go with the ho, ho, ho again. What are you, Santa Claus? Oh, yes. <laughs> uh huh. Apparently, it's interesting. Hmm. All right, he's probably gonna tell us come now. Ooh, Yugen Hagen's about to drown. Oh, we're about to drown. We're in some kind of watery grave. Doom. Doom. Oh, never mind. We did move out of the way. Now, go inside. Hope maybe inside or. Inside. Yeah. Dun dun dun. Okay, now we have to move back in. Back here again, huh? huh? This was just a screen to project an image. Okay. Look. Look at the image. Project on the screen of the water. All right. All right. So there's an image. Ooh, FMV kind of. Kind of quasi FMV. 
Ooh. Hey, it's Iris! Hi, Iris! <laughs> Oh, doing the uh, dun dun dun. I can bear. I can't even hear it. So. Uh, it's Aaron. There's ah. Remember, they were, we were talking about white materia. There it is. When she, when she got stabbed, white materia fell into the water. We go down the hole. And there it is, just sitting right there. Remember, they talked about if it's activated or whatever like that, it turns like a greenish color. Mm -hmm. And you saw it down there. <laughs> It's glowing. Yes, it is. Oh, oh, oh. It's pale green. Yes, it is. Eris. Eris has already prayed for Holy. After I gave up the black material to Sephra, Eris's word came true in my dreams. He said she was the only one who could stop Sephra to do that. There was a secret here. That was Holy. That's why she had the white material. Eris knew about here what she had to do. Eris has left us great hope, but it cost us cost her her life, her future. I'm sorry, Eris. Eris, I should have figured this out sooner. But you didn't. You left us without saying a word. It was all of, it was all so sudden, so I couldn't think. That's why it took so long for me to find out. But Eris, I understand now. Eris. I'll do the rest. All right. You, it's we, 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 we. Yeah. The thing Aerith left for us, we gotta take care of it. We, 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 we. Thank you, Aerith. Aerith's vo Aerith's voice has already reached the planet. Just look at the glow of the white materia. Yep. But how about Holy? How can Holy isn't how come Holy isn't moving? Oh, we got an answer for that. Why? Something's getting in the way. You know. Yep. He's the only one that could do it. Yep. Sephiroth, where are you? Yep, Sephiroth is in the way of Holy. So he's kind of like pushing Holy back. Well, we're done here. So now all you got to do now is uh to try to talk to Vegan Hogan one more time, just see what he says, and then we're going to... Well, I guess we can't talk to him. Okay. That's all we can do here? That's to get out of here? Yes. Alright, so... Uh-oh. What we got here? What the... Sorry! I was a little surprised! What happened? You remember when the Junot cannon disappeared? Actually, Rufus moved it. Moved it? That big thing? Where? Why? Rufus wants to destroy Sephiroth with it. That cannon operates on huge materia, but the huge material has already been used in the rocket plant. So since the cannon is useless right now, he decided to move it. To a place where materia no, where Mako is gathered. And where is that? Ooh. Is that Meteor? That looks like Meteor to me. Man, that looks a little too close for comfort, guys. It's kind of like the moon in Termina from Majora's Mask. It's getting closer! Now if you just if, now if you look up and see Meteor with the big ugly face like from Majora's Mask, it's going to be like, shit my pants or something. <laughs> but I'm not good at editing. I put one in it. <laughs> little troll face, like a little moon face. Just going... <laughs> I can probably edit, I can pro I can probably edit that in there. That'd be funny. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm not gonna do that though. It would be funny though. Oh, so that's where the cannon's at. And look where it's at. Doesn't that place look familiar? Mm-hmm. That's why, Reeves. It's your job to adjust the reactor's output. I see. <laughs> Don't worry about adjusting it, Reeves. Once you open it up all the way, everything will go full speed! <laughs> the president sure done it this time! But we can only defeat Sephiroth, the idea that Meteor was also disappear is based on different objectives. Please remember, Mr. President, it was my idea to fire Maker Reactor Power Shells! Do the shells really reach that far northern border? Mr. 
Mr. President, please do not call out a Mako cannon. The new weapon will be called... The Sister Ray! Oh, dear God. <laughs> <laughs> yep, they named it The Sister Ray. Alright, so now we are finally out of here, so... We know where the cannon's at. If you notice, that was Vigar. You give give everything away, why don't you, Danny? Well, I mean, they could see that was Vigar. And that, and that was the mm -hmm. I don't know, unless you got some people on it. <laughs> be nice, Ken. Be nice. <laughs> but, uh... But, yeah, so that's our next objective, is to head to... Uh, it looks like we were heading to return to the beginning of the game and heading back to Midgar. About fucking time. And let's go stop, I guess, what is now called the Sister Ray? Fuck it, it's a Mako Cannon. It's a Mako Cannon. Of course it's called a Sister Ray because a woman named it. Oh, okay, that was a little, that was a little overboard. Sorry, DK. <laughs> Bad DK. <laughs> that was a little sexist. Bad <laughs> three. To oh, here comes all the uh, dislikes. <laughs> Stop being wow. sexist, DK. Oh wow, we actually made it through that area without getting into a battle. That's me knocking on the wood. Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> all right, so flash all. Oh, you didn't get it fast enough. Still got the damage. Sure. Damn you, dance! Oh, no only one dance though, and Cloud missed one. It don't matter. <laughs> counter attack! Mm. So it's like, counter attack! Yes. What, was that counter attack, or did you actually put that in? No. Uh, it was oh, just, just a command. Okay. Okay, two high potions out of it. Problem is, we're, we're maxed, maxed out, out on high potions. Yeah! I forgot about that. Honestly, let's head back to the highway, and I guess it's time to head to Big R. Yep. Alright. Uh, boom. Boom. Back for the Ancient Forest, and this is probably one of the absolute last times. If you haven't gotten Kajada yet, get him now. Yeah. If you, in case you haven't uh, if you forgot, go to the video where uh, we're heading to the Ancient Forest the first time, you'll see us get Kajada. So if you actually want to get Kajada, one of your final opportunities to get it. So, just take a look at that. Alright, so let's head to the high wind. Mm -hmm. uh, something's happening. Oh, uh oh, we got a rumbly rumbly. What, what the? Oh, what the? Ah, oh, I missed the wrong landmark. Oh, there's Midgar. Something's happening off the coast of Megar, it looks like. Uh-oh. What is this? It's a uh, big, huge... That thing. looks ugly as fuck. <laughs> yeah. Ladies and gentlemen. Wait for it. Wait for it. We can, e we can either make this a relatively short episode and just take care of the next episode, or uh, we can take care of it now. I mean, we can leave it as a cliffhanger right here for one second. And it's up. We're at 19 minutes. Well, actually, let's get to the cut. What's wrong? It's a strange signal! Uh -oh. From where? It's coming from this person? Wow! <laughs> hey! What's wrong with the gate sis? That was a surprise, the controls went crazy. This ain't good. Weapon came out of the sea and is sailing straight for Midgar. New weapon should stop him, right? I don't know if it's ready or not. Hey, what's gonna to happen to Marlene? Don't you worry, now Marlene's in a safe place. She's with Eris' mama. What was that scratching just now? As long as Marlene is safe, who cares what happens, right? I've been itching to save this TF for a while now. When you blew the Midgar number one up, how many folks do you think died? That was for the life of the planet. You gotta expect a few casualties. 
A few? What do you mean a few? What may be a few to y'all is everyone's a good who died. Protect the planet. Ha! Y'all sure sound good. Ain't no one got. Uh, ain't no one got to go against you. So who do you, do you think you can do whatever y'all want? I don't want to hear that from no one in general. Nothing I can do about that. Stop it. Okay, so Barrett, he knows what he did. But we need to make our can be forgotten no matter what the reason. Boobs! Right! You haven't forgotten it, right? I know you. You can't quit the company because you're worried about the people in Midgar, right? Cloud? Okay, let's go. We'll beat weapon ourselves. Yeah. Hey, Cloud. You think we can win against that monster? We got a chance of winning, right? How would I know? <laughs> There's no reason for us to just let him go. We're going to Midgar and fight Weapon. Come on. Let's move. But! We're going to take care of Weapon the next episode. When we go back, we're going to head toward Midgar. Actually, better. We need to probably need to head to Midgar now. Yeah. Let's get right here. Alright. Well, uh, when we come back, we're going to, uh, face off against Weapon and beat him and see what we gotta do. You have a good day, and we will see y'all next time on Let's Go Play Final Fantasy VII. This is DKS3 is a crazy gamer with The Laws 85. Sign it out.